The question is whether KClO3 is soluble or insoluble in water. This is potassium chlorate. And the short answer is that it's soluble in water. There's a few ways we can tell. First, we could have memorized the solubility rules. So this is a brief set of the solubility rules. And the first rule, group one elements. Potassium, that's in group one on the periodic table. They're soluble. So compounds with group one elements, like potassium chlorate, are soluble in water. We could also look at a solubility chart. So here's our solubility chart. The positive ions, they're right here. So we're looking for potassium right here, K plus, and then ClO3, that is the chlorate, it's ClO3 minus, and we can go across and down, and you can see that S. That means that KClO3 will be soluble in water. It'll dissolve It'll split apart into its ions, dissociate. You'll have K plus ions, and you'll have the ClO3 minus, the chlorate ions. And they'll be aqueous, dissolved in water, so you can put an AQ after them. There's one more way we can tell whether KClO3 is soluble or insoluble, and that's just to get some and put it in water. Observe what happens. Based on the chart here and based on the solubility rules, we'd expect that it would be soluble. This is Dr. B answering the question whether KClO3 is soluble or insoluble in water. It is soluble. Thanks for watching.